What is up Shark Army, it's me GameShark and welcome back to another video. Today we are playing a game called Supraland. Now this is the demo version, I came across this game on Steam, I bumped into it, I had a little look and I thought you know what, this game looks interesting, looks different. So today I thought I'd give it a little go, showcase it off to you guys. You can all play the demo of this for free on Steam before you purchase it if you do uh, go ahead and do that. But basically Superland is a first person Metroidvania puzzle game. And the main sources of its inspiration are from Zelda, Metroid and Portal. So basically, Superland assumes that you are intelligent and it lets you play independently. The story is minimal, it gives you an overarching goal to pursue and then it sets you free. And despite the child friendly visuals, the game targets experienced players because it is very challenging and the playtime on this game is around 12 to 25 hours depending how long it takes you. But we can do things from like finding secret upgrades, solving puzzles, beating up monsters, finding new abilities and helping us to reach new places. So yeah it's a little bit different to what I'm used to but it just looked really nice. I like the looks of the game and the sounds of it as well so I thought I'd give it a little go and if you guys do enjoy it and then you can try it out for yourself as well so let's just see how good this game is. Oh my god, and here we are! Look at this! It looks amazing, look! Yes! It looks very, very nice. The detail is insane. Okay, so I don't know what we've got to do. I've never played this. This is the first time of jumping into this game with you. And I'm excited. Oh my god, everyone's outside discussing something. Oh, hello there! Do I look like you as well? You look sad. You all look sad. What's happening? Okay, well, I'm guessing we've got to talk to the king. We're out of water. Please go down the pipe and find out what is wrong. Okay. Um, find out why the red town is out of water. Um, oh, no. This is not good. Okay, well, here goes nothing. Whee! Oh, this is creepy. I love the detail. I heard it's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Oh no, we've got a sword, guys. If you have one of these, it causes two damage. Okay, okay, so attack defense. Is there anything down here? Okay, let's go. Jump over things, attack. Hopefully, there's no monsters just yet. Super Games presents. Oh, got some coins. Nice, two out of 30. <laughs> Look at this. This is where people were cut out and made. That is insane. Okay, so maybe we've got to go through here. Oh, no. Our first enemy. Get away. This stupid skull skeleton thing. Right, okay. Let's keep moving. Oh, there's another one. You're mine, boy! Whoa! You can just spam it and get wrecked. What is this? Oh, it's life. We don't need any of that. We are too good. Okay, okay so we can crouch with control. Oh, wow. Something's happened here. More people have been cut out. Oh, look at this. I found something that we can turn. There we go. So we've put out the gas or the fire or whatever it was. Now we can go ahead and break this and make our way through. So carry this stone and we can place it on there. And that's open the door. Nice. I'm getting used to this already. Okay, well, well, we've got some weird blue men here. These must be the bad ones. They're the enemies. We're the red against the blues. We found out what the problem is. The Blues! Go to the Blueville and talk to their king. Okay, sir. Any idea where that will be? Oh, look. We can find crates, I'm guessing, there. We can buy better sword damage, speed. Uh, let's get this one. Sword damage is it gone up by one. Okay, nice. Maybe well, that was too soon to buy that, but... 
can find coins all the way around here as well. We're going to do this so we can buy upgrades and get better damage. Because the enemies are going to get tough. There's another one here. Is there any more around before I go on my adventures? Oh, look. Okay. Oh, who are you? Are you a farmer? We do like farmers. For more health, mix some green leaves and water in this juicer. Green leaves. Why does it have a blue side anyway? Is that, an, is that a rubber? An eraser that they call it? Why does it have a blue side? At least the red part is much bigger. If this is an eraser, which I think it might be, I'm not sure. But I always got told in school that the blue side was always like made to rub out pen rather than pencil, which the pink side does. I don't know. If I, I don't even know if that is a rubber or not. It kind of looks like one. We've got some more coins there. We might be able to buy a better upgrade soon. Then we've got to go to the blue town. Oh, we found one of these, a secret area. Oh, okay, well, maybe it's a mattress. Uh, that may not be a rubber. I don't know what that is. Um, let's pick this up. Didn't we say we could sell these for a little bit of money? We'll come back up here in a second. You can't sprint in this, so... Well, not as I know of, anyway. No, you can't. Okay, so we put this here. And we get some new things on here. So we can buy elf regeneration. Speed times two would be good. I could do with that. What's in here? Another coin. Bring golden barrels to the shop for power-ups. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to find. Oh, there's some more over here. I do want to be faster because he's very slow. Oh, so these are the flowers. What does this do? Oh, it's opened that door. We've got to, oh, we've got to be fast. We need to. We definitely need to have the speed up for that. Go, 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 go. Yeah, we aren't fast enough for that. That's never happening. So if I put one of these flowers into this juice thing over here. Oh, did it say this? Grass? If we put this into the juicer, like it said. Maybe it works with a flower? I don't know. Hmm, maybe not. Oh, there's something down here. We've got a break. What's this? Something needs to be pressed on there. So that's going to open that door if we can find something to put onto the switch to keep it held down. Can you find something to put in here? What goes in there? Hmm. Oh, it's another one of those. Okay. I don't know where we'll find that. Amazing game. So much better than its processor. Found some more of those. What does this do? Nine. Nine? Nine. Nine. What? Perfect. Five out of seven. I have no idea what that is. Ooh. What does this do? Huh? I have no idea what that does either. This is very confusing. We'll have to find things out as we get further into the game. Right, I've got this here. Maybe this can go in the door. I've just found it. It's like a light. There's a few of them around. Maybe it has to be a different colour. I don't know. Oh? The colour seems to be wrong. Oh, darn it. We need white. Okay, well, maybe... Can we take the white one out? No. I have no idea how you get on there. There's some coins up here. Oh, we can just go to the back. Silly me. Okay, let's go and get these coins. That should be the 12th one. And I think... Well, we've got 13 now. We can get the next upgrade. Look at the giant red crystal behind the cliffs. You should go there. Oh, down there. Look at that. Okay, well, if you say so. Do we need 80 coins to open that? Wow. Should we buy the speed? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, we are faster. Let's do this treasure chest. We should be a lot faster now. Ready? Oh, yes, we are. <laughs> Enemy health. You can now run faster and jump twice as far. Oh, that is awesome. And enemy health bars. You can see enemy health bars and how much damage you do to them. That is great. So we are ready to go, I think. Let's do this. Let's go to Blueville. When you have the force cube, come talk to me again. Okay. Look at all these. Lots of coins here. What? Oh, we've got another barrel. Um, Another yellow one there. What is that? Whoa! What does this do? Oh, so that gets us back out. Oh, okay. Oh, his enemy here. Okay. Ah, oh, you can see the enemy damage now and the health. That is oh, you little. Oh, damn, he hit me twice. That wasn't very pleasant. Hey, we've got another barrel here. What a force 
with a force cube, you could get the barrel out of there and bring it to the shop. Ah, oh, okay, so we can't take it out just yet because when you carry, carry it, it doesn't fit. Damn. Oh. Well, that wasn't good either. We need this force cube wherever it is. It sounds good, though. Wow. There's so much to this game. Oh, okay. Here they, here they come. There's two of them. Oh, no. We've only got 10 health out of 25. That's not good. Oh. Oh, no. They're everywhere. How do I get my health up? I'm nearly dead. This is not good. Oh, did I just eat these little red berries on the cactuses? I think you can. Oh, yes. So they give you health. Okay, that's good to know. Right, let's go this way. There's a red person up there. Some more of these gold coins. Look how much we've got. So many up here. I can't afford the double jump to get over there. Oh, we need a double jump as well. That would be nice. What's up here? Oh, double jump over there would be good too. Okay, your red crystal. Ooh! Secret area. What have we got? Loot. Enemies now drop coins or health when killed. You get more coins if your health is full. Oh, that is amazing. Okay. Well, we've got 30 out of 30, so we can't actually carry any more. So we might have to go back to the shop and buy something before we adventure out. Whee! I nearly made that. So I'm going to go ahead and buy something from the shop because we, we can't carry any more coins at the moment. So we can get max coins by two or sword. We can't get the sword damage yet. Health regeneration. Oh, we can get both of these. So we can get that and that. Nice. So you can carry... We can now carry twice as much money, which is awesome. And what was the other one? Was it health or something? So I think we are ready to go to Blueville. We can carry a lot of coins. We've got some good damage. We should be okay. What's this over here? I'll come with you. Open that door for us. Okay. Well, I think there was something down here. Oh, we are not making that. Oh, I think we need like a slide or something. No, we are making that. Okay. Let's go. Enough messing. Oh, there's another monster here. Let's check to see if he drops coins. And we've got full health as well. Nice. Okay, let's go. How do we open the door? Open that door? How? Oh, there's a switch up there. Oh, okay. I see what we've got to do. I thought it was as simple as pulling the switch, but obviously not. So we've got to go up here. Then we've got to turn right. Go up here. We've got to jump. Oh, we made it. Jump over here. We got it. Whoop. Blue man. He's gone. We can switch that. Let's open the door. Let's go quickly before it closes. There we go. We're coming through, guys. We're coming through. Let's move on. I'm following you, my friend. Just don't die on me. More coins. Don't forget these. It's almost like... Look, the toys. These are bricks. It's like um, we are playing a game through a child's story. You know, like little stick men and they're making this story. Reds versus blues. You know, and they're playing with them with their hands. And we're actually controlling it. That's what it feels like, which is it's good. I like that. It's a great idea for a game. It's challenging. There's like a lot to it. You've got to like take your time and... There's different puzzles that you've got to do. Obviously, this is he easy right now. So, it's going to be more challenging. Don't walk on there. Open that. I don't know. We need a key or something. What's this way? I'm exploring everywhere. It's a very exploration type of game. More coins. 23 out of 60. Nice. Okay, looks like there's another door we need to press here. To get through there. Whoa! Oh, you are kidding me. That sends us all the way back. Get the MacGuffin from the Red Crystal Tower. How do we get up there? Honey, honey, do you have something to shoot that thing above me? Um, no. How do I shoot things? I have no idea. Ooh, chest here. We've opened it. Health bar. The latest innovation in technology giving you a visual re representation of your health. Huh? We've got a health bar now. Bright parts of the bar indicate how far your health automatically regenerates. Ah, interesting. That's pretty cool. 
I need to try and work my way up. We need to get higher. The problem is we're not very good at jumping, so if I'm right, we need to come up here. We need to work our way around here. Hopefully jump on there. There we go, we've got one guy. Up there you can get the giant crystal. It conceals a powerful Mac Guffin, I was told. Okay. Um, so do we jump on top of there? Yes. If you balance over this wall and up the pipe, you will get to the big tower. You will need a triple jump. What? We haven't got a triple jump. What? Are we stuck? No. Nope. There we go. Wow. How am I going to get over there? That is not happening. We're never getting over there. Hmm. Look at that for a jump. There's a key up here as well. That's the key for this, I'm guessing. Don't know how we get that, though. This is tough, man. This is tough. How are we going to get over this? I don't understand how we can get over that. Okay, well, we'll make it up onto this now. We're quite high. Um, I don't think I'm going to make that. These are some big jumps. There's a chest up there. I don't know how we crossed that brick to get to that because those are in the way. I don't understand that. Let's try and jump here. Okay, we made that. Oh, it's just lots of money. I thought that maybe gave us double jump or something, but it hasn't. Oh, we're not fast enough to press this either. How are we going to do that? That is insane. We need more speed. I'm already struggling what to do, guys. Well, we are full out on coins, and I still don't know how to get up here. So maybe we're going to have to go back and see if we can buy something, maybe? We need another power-up. We need double jump, I think, because we're just not good enough. We just can't jump high enough, so... Let's go back this way. Oh, there's a chest on there. The only thing we can buy is 65 coins. There's no more barrels we can find either. Oh, there's a little passageway here I found. A nice chest, secret area. What's going to be in here? Oh, critical damage. Critical chance, that's not too bad. It's not the enemies that's the problem though. We need more speed and jump. All right, let's go up here. Because I see that there's some coins. Oh, we're full out as well. Can we go higher up? There's a candle. Okay, so in order to get further, we need barrels. Because barrels will give us upgrades, and then that means we can get better abilities like double jump and a cannon to shoot things. We need better stuff. And there's a few barrels that are hiding down here which need to work out how to get them out because there's little puzzles you have to do in order to get the barrels. So I believe there is one down here somewhere um, that we need to get out here. But obviously the barrel needs to be on there in order for us to get out. But this will launch anything that's placed on there. So if we get the barrel, for example, we can put that there. If we stand on it, oh, the barrel gets jumped over. And we can actually respawn the barrel back, which obviously means we can get out there ourselves. But this is good because these barrels are going to give us new abilities. So we could just keep putting them on here. So let's get out of here ourselves. Now where have these barrels gone? Where are they? Where have they disappeared to? Maybe we can't launch or respawn the barrel. Because when you respawn the barrel, that's going to take it away from there. So we, we've got to use another way out. So if we put that on there like so and launch that over. And then we can obviously get through here. There we go, the barrel's there now. So I was hoping we could glitch that and, and use more than one, but we can't. So now we exchange this in, we'll be able to buy a new upgrade, hopefully. And it's like a double jump or maybe a gun that we can shoot. I don't know, but we're going, we're going to need it. So this has gave us a force cube. Okay. Oh, what are you doing here? Get out of here. So this guy said come and see him when we got the force cube, right? There he is. Go in there and spawn the force cube underneath yourself in front of the, in front of you, but under your feet. So look down. Oh, look at this. Okay. So we can press F and we will spawn a force cube, which basically lifts us up. That is cool. Now there's another one here that we can use. Hopefully, if we force ourselves up, we can break through here. Nice. Oh, hold down the force cube button to preview the spawn location and create a light. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. That is cool. And there we go. We've got a secret area. 
And we have got more money. Nice. We need abilities, though. Let's get out of here. That's good. We've got a new uh, special ability here, which is awesome. So what else could we use this for? Oh, a force cube could get the barrel out of there, bring it to the shop. How could the force cube get out of here? Oh, so maybe like, can we jump? Okay, so I'm guessing what we do is this. We're gonna put the barrel down, like so. Jump ourselves up. Can we get down there? No, okay. Hmm. Maybe, can we block? Can we block this off like so that should hold it now there we go so we've used the barrel that's holding it if we can get out we should be able to there we go we've got a barrel guys so we can use it to block things this is another one that's awesome so we can go and exchange this now it might give us a new ability oh no leave me alone this hopefully is something useful there's four more left double jump yes there it is oh crap what are you doing? Get away. Oh, we nearly died. We nearly died. Let's go and get some health. Oh, no. Leave me alone. Oh, no. Please don't die. There we go. We've got some health. We get health from killing these as well. So we've got double jump now, which is actually very useful. So we should be able to make it past um, these difficult things. Oh, ow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Who are you? Oh, you are tough. Oh, these are strong things. Oh my god, they were so strong. They did give us coins though, which is nice. Pick these up. Ooh. Okay, well let's try this again. Now we've got the force cube. This should... Hopefully, work with the double jump. I might be able to get out of there with the double jump now. Will the double jump get over that? I don't know if it will. Right, maybe let's use the force cube. Uh, we'll go, so we can go higher now. Yes, we did it, guys. There we go. I don't know what that does. Oh, it uses a jump so you can now get up here all the time. That is, that is cool. So, we can get up the pipe. We need triple jump to get over there, though. Oh, these are, these are tough things. So now we're getting further in the game, they're sending trickier monsters. These are so tough. But they do give us coins, which we need. We need some more chests, though. Oh, oh no! We died! What happens when we die? Okay, we've still got all of our stuff. We've got 30 out of money, we've still got the force cube, okay. Well, there's still a lot more to do, guys. I think there's a few more chests we need, like there's one over there. We should be able to double jump over there now. So let's see if we can try and get this one up there. So in order to do that, we need to get up here. We need the triple jump to get across that pipe. So can we double jump over here? Oh, I think we're going to need a triple jump for that. There is no chance in hell. This is tricky. This is definitely using your mind. Um, but I think I'm going to end that one there, guys. Because I've been playing this for a long time. I don't know how long it's going to be in the video. Because I've just been trying to work it out myself, to be honest. Oh, more coins. Nice. So I'm not sure. But this is tricky. And I don't know what else there is to do right now. Oh, there's a chest up there as well. How do I get that? That is a good question. So yeah, I'm going to wrap that one up. And might try and play around with this a little bit longer. And sort it out myself. Try to drop the cube on those monster heads. What monster heads? You can drop a, a cube on them. I wonder what that does. Is there any more monsters? Let's go and see. But yeah, this is this is uh, tricky. Oh, the cube kills them instantly. Wow, that's great. Right, guys. Well, yeah, that is it. That's been Superland. You can try it for free, the demo, on Steam. Go and check it out. Put links down below in the description if you like platform puzzle kind of games. With a little bit of Zelda like with the combat, the fighting, the crafting and stuff and getting all the upgrades. And then, yeah, it's, it's for you. It's very addicting. There's a lot to it. You need the upgrades to go further on. In order to get the upgrades, you need to find the chests and then save up the coins to buy them. If you did enjoy, make sure to hit that like button. Let me know down below in the comments if you want to see more of this or maybe if you'd give it a go yourself. If you love the games Portal and Zelda, then this is definitely for you. That's what the game took inspiration from. So uh, you can definitely see that as well. You can see that in the game for sure. 
But yeah, until then, I'll see you on the next one. Subscribe if you're new around here. Make sure to stay notified by hitting that notification bell to see more uploads. I'm uploading every single day this week, Monday to Friday. There's going to be a new video, so stay tuned for that. It's going to be incredible. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the next one. Stay safe, stay awesome, and peace.